The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. All right, Coach Page, you signed eight new swimmers for this season. Uh, were you trying to fill any roles, any needs in this year's class? Absolutely. Um, on the men's side, I thought we had a critical need for some breaststrokers. I also think we had a critical need for some sprint fly um, and also some distance. So those are some areas that we really addressed. Um, and it's also important to uh, make sure we're um, bringing in new talent. So I was excited with uh, how strong our incoming class is. You signed four men. First off, we'll talk about Tyler Graves. He's going to swim. Uh, mainly the fly for you. What What is it you liked about him so much? Sure. Well, he's just an all-around talented young man. Um, he does bring to the table strong fly for us, um, but also options in the freestyle and breaststroke, um, which is a wonderful combination. I think that uh, what Tyler brings specifically is a passion to the sport, and we're excited to, to have him on board and uh, to welcome him to the Eagle family, for sure. Uh, talk about East Tennessee native Seth Hughes. He's uh -huh. in the back for you. He is. Um, Seth is a very talented young man, hasn't been swimming tremendously long, and has already shown tremendous um, improvement and future potential, um, being able to compete at the, some of the highest levels already. So um, we're very excited that he's part of our score as well and glad to have him here. Uh, you ventured to the Midwest and you add another Josh. Yeah. Josh Terrell is going to swim the breast in the distance I am. Mm -hmm. Um, Terrell, Josh Terrell, he is a fantastic young man. We're really glad that um, he's made the decision to come here all the way from Kansas. Um, he brings a lot in the um, breaststroke, um, specifically the 200 um, IM and the 400 IM as well. Uh, so we're really thankful for, for Josh and what he brings specifically. Um, I think one of the neatest things that he brings is uh, some of his interesting um, training experiences. He's um, done some of the USRPT training, which is a new fad recently. Um, and we've done a little bit of that, um, and it'll be interested to, to see, interesting to see how he adapts to our training program. Um, I know he'll do very well for us. Uh, you had another Josh, another Texan, give Manny Mendoza, uh, a mm -hmm. fellow Texan, Josh Wynn, be a distance free stall for you. Yes, Joshua Wynn from Nitro Swimming. Um, that's actually an area that we recruited very heavily um, due to me being down there previously. So we're glad to both have Manny and previously Hannah Kaiser and, and now Josh Wynn. Um, he adds tremendous amount of stability in our distance group. Um, he also adds quite a bit of uh, toughness, which I think is a really an important tactic and what, what we need. Um, his time stand up very well already. And as he matures, I think he'll uh, be a great asset to the Eagles men's swimming team. We jump over to the women's side now. We'll start off with a swimmer from North North Georgia, Olivia Winkler will be swimming the IM for you. Absolutely. Olivia is, again, much like some of the guys on the men's side, very talented in multiple areas. Um, I would recruit her individually for just her fly or just her back or just her breaststroke. Um, so she is able to do the IM specifically, um, but also um, step in, you know, maybe uh, second place, you know, lane five or something for our uh, breaststroke and backstroke uh, and fly already as a freshman. So that, that'll be really, really strong for us. Um, I think Olivia, being from the Chattahoochee Gold team, um, is another great person that will be a good fit with the ladies team, what we're building here, for sure. You bring in another swimmer from the mid-state, Jacqueline Stone, she'll be doing the fly for you. Absolutely. Um, Jacqueline Stone, I don't think I could say enough positive things about her and her attitude, which I think is really important. On a swim team, you don't just need fast swimmers. You also need people that are fast swimmers and have a great attitude because what we do is so brutal on our bodies and brutal on our mind. Um, and so what she brings is um, that in spades. And we're really, really excited to get her here um, to be able to be a great team asset. And then also we're looking forward to see her develop into a talented young lady for us, for sure. You get a freshman coming in, distance free, she'll join up with Lexi Raybon. Mm -hmm. Eliza, Eliza Peterson mm -hmm. from Hopkinsville, Georgia. Uh, Liza, she's wonderful, another one with a contagious attitude. I'm looking forward to seeing her also really develop and strengthen in the distance free areas. Uh, we need some people that can really um, be competitive in the thousand of the mile, and we're excited that she's on board. A uh, great young lady that we've had the honor of recruiting, for sure. Uh, last week we're bringing in from Clearwater, Florida, she was one of the breasts in the IM, Alex Norris. Alex, absolutely. We were fortunate to, to have Alex uh, commit to us specifically what Alex um, was able to bring to the table is the breaststroke, which is something, um, you know, it, 
it's really a need for us every year at this point. So we're excited that she brings that. Also, she's got some capabilities in the IM and just an all around uh, talented young lady uh, that um, knows what it's like at the top level. And I'm glad that she'll be on our team and can bring that experience to this uh, incoming class of Eagles as well. Really excited to work with all of the young men and young women uh, for sure as we go into our third year of uh, this program. Congratulations on signing class. Thank you, very excited. Paige McCord, Carson Men Women's and Men's Swim Coach.